The Lord Jesus had died. It was just like he said. Mary and others wept because he was dead. Nicodemus and Joseph put him in the tomb. The disciples were saddened, all filled with gloom. Early the third morning, after Jesus had died, Mary visited the tomb. She mourned and she cried. Then suddenly, an earthquake, an angel was there. The tough soldiers on guard, they got a huge scare. The angel opened the tomb and sat on the stone. Mary was frightened, she felt all alone. The angel said words that changed her mind. Don't be afraid, were words that felt kind. The soldiers lay on the floor, shaking with fear. Mary was comforted, the angel was here. She listened to his message, the words that he said. Jesus is alive, he's risen from the dead. The stone wasn't rolled away to let Jesus out. She saw where Jesus lay, so there was no doubt that Jesus was gone, he'd risen from the dead. Mary remembered, that's what Jesus had said. Simon, Peter and John came running to the tomb. They saw Jesus had risen, this lifted their gloom. The grave clothes with handkerchief were lying beside. Mary just stood outside the tomb and she cried. A voice from behind her asked why it was that she cried. Mary thought it was the gardener, with tears she replied. Jesus said, Mary, this was a voice that she knew. She turned and replied, Master, can this really be you? It was Jesus. He was risen, just as he said. He came to die and was now risen from the dead. He died for our sins, but God raised him to life so that we could be free from sin, evil and strife. God came so we could have peace deep within. We could know forgiveness from all of our sin. By trusting in Jesus who died and has risen, we can know peace with God and be forgiven. Mary struggled for a little time just to believe. Could this really be true or did her eyes deceive? But it really was true and she'd truly believe. Trust now in Jesus and his pardon receive.